Okay, so we are on a new adventure. We are making a new YouTube channel and it's called The Grinds Finds. Uh, this is for storage units, flea markets, estate sales, and yard sales and stuff like that. We have our first unit here that we've bid it on. It has a red lock. We're waiting for the guy to come and take the locks off. We have no idea what is in this unit just yet. And hopefully we find something good. So basically what we're gonna do with these units that we buy, these bid on, these storage units, uh, we, we look for specific items, jewelry, comic books, collectibles, stuff like that. Uh, it's stuff we can flip online and everything else that we find is either gonna go, go in the trash or sell on Facebook Marketplace to cover the cost of our bids on the unit. This unit right here, we won for $81. So once the guy comes and opens it up, we'll uh, dig right into it. All right, all right, here we go. My man Steve's opening us up. Let's see what we get in here. Ready? Oh yeah. Oh shit, this unit is packed, Steve. <laughs> All right. Yeah, we have some goodies in there. Yeah, we do. Hopefully we do, right? All right, so our plan is we've taken out the two mattresses that were in here, the vacuum cleaner and the lamp. Uh, so our plan is to make a beeline to the back and see what we can find. Well, this is nice. See what we can find within all the units. I mean, within all the little cubby holes and stuff like that which we just found something in here. So let's check this out. Let me get this out. All right, let's see what we got here. Let's put down a trusty flashlight and see what this is. Come on, open up, motherfucker. A little piece of electrical equipment, I guess. Is this like a defibrillator or something? Reusable self-adhesive electrode. All right, it looks like it goes on your arms or your shoulders, but we're gonna do a re little research on this and we'll let you know, figure out what it is. Okay, so we're making some progress. Right here, we got 10. 20 30 bucks right what we found we found that electronic piece so far on it, back here it looks like there's some more electronics i don't know what this is just yet but we're gonna pull it out shortly we have it looks like there's a whole matching furniture set in here which is awesome because this piece up here is just beautiful and it looks like we have another one back there, a bigger one. It looks like we have the whole bed set, bed frame, and everything for that set. Uh, there's a lot of hidden bins back here that I didn't even know back up there. So we're gonna continue checking it out. We got a little, a whole bunch of these little bins like this we're gonna start going through and see where we're at. Okay, so, hold on a minute. Let me tell you something, digging through units is no joke. So that piece of electronic we saw back here, let me go that way. That piece of electronic we saw back there turns out to be a safe. Now, we gotta see if this thing is, how to open this thing. So it's locked. So we're gonna have to find out how to break through this safe unless we can find the key because it sounds like there's something in it. So hopefully we can find the key for it because no, it's not opening. So, oh, something's in there. All right. All right, so we found a couple more small boxes. Let's go through them. We just opened them up. This one looks like it's a clock, another clock. We'll pull this camera out. Take a look at that. What's this unit here? A little DVD player. Nice. 
Okay. So we got some stuff in this box. Let's open up this box and see what we got in here. We're going to put this stuff back in the cubby hole over there. Once we get that other big white box out right there with the black tape, we'll pack everything else back up nice as we're going through it. All right, this box is a bust. It looks just like paperwork. But of course, we'll go through everything because you have to look through every individual page. But this is a bust right now. There's nothing in here we can use. Yeah, this looks like it's all paperwork as well. We're not even going to go through this now. All right, we picked out this little rainbow kit here. It looks like an art kit. It's filled with all types of art supplies. All different markers, crayons, pencils, pastels, and it's jam-packed. So we're looking at another 20 bucks for this. Okay, I found a nice, a nice mirror here. Another 20 bucks for that. We found a glass shelving for the uh, TV stand, and it's wrapped really, really nice. We found a little ottoman back here. I don't know how we're going to get it out, uh, but it seems to be filled with stuff. So we're going to check out this right now and see what we got in here. Uh, we're not going crazy. We're not taking everything out of this unit. Uh, we're just looking through it at the moment. Uh, my main thing is I want to get that safe back home and crack that sucker up. But we got a lot of stuff up here. We got a lot of bins, a lot of really nice furniture. So just from what we see already, we've already doubled our money. So yes. All right, so in that ottoman was just a bunch of picture frames and stuff like that. Some new shelving units, some new floating shelving units that we're gonna use, that we can use. So uh, we got about 60 bucks in that ottoman. All right, so we found this here. It looks to be a surround sound system. Nice big long piece. Wireless surround ready. Probably like a home speaker or something, Bluetooth. Hopefully we can find more pieces to this. We still gotta go through all of that. Man, we got a lot of stuff in this little unit. So just these pieces here, these reusable pads, which we have a lot of 20 of them, they're going for 50 bucks just for the pads alone. And these are brand new. I haven't seen anything yet with the component yet. Uh, but we'll take this home along with our safe. Uh, so we'll put this down over here with our safe. And uh, we'll take those two things home for now. Everything else we're going to start packing up. Uh, after I get into that piece of wood right there. It looks like the top lifts up. Uh, man, we got a lot to do in here. Alright, so we were going to get into this piece here. But we're not. Because I found a box mark with tools right here. And that, we need to see what's inside those. We're looking for jewelry and things like that. But we did find these wall lamps, sconces, I guess you can call them. They look pretty cool. They light up on the sides. You get 20 bucks for the set there. It looks like we've got some nice, I don't know if these are crystal lamps. I highly doubt it. But we do have four of these. Uh, we get 10 bucks a lamp for that. All right, so there's no tools in this box. It looks like that box has paperwork on it. These are glass shelves. There is a shitload of brand a shitload of brand new floor mats. I mean, when I say a shitload, I got to say like at least 50. So there's at least 50 in there. We also found this little handheld Hoover... I guess it's a brand new steam cleaner, a carpet washer, maybe like that. So even if we sell, hold on. So even if we sell all those floor mats at a buck each, right there, 50 bucks paid for our unit, basically, right? With everything else that we're finding. All right, let's pack this up and let's get up there. Okay, so these things here turned out to be empty. <coughs> but <coughs> but they're still really nice. We got two that I can see. Uh, 20 bucks each on those. Uh, this here was filled with beautiful running uh, carpet. So we'll check that out as well. 
But the exciting thing is somehow, somehow being stuck between all of this here, we found this and it looks like there's stuff in here. So could be jewelry boxes, but I, just, I, I can't get to it at the moment. Oh Jesus, that was filled with money. Ah, oh, that just fell out. That was filled with money. So that's a good thing. What the heck is this? Coffee pot, maybe? I don't know. But what do we got here? Look at that. Oh, oh whoa. Dollars, half dollars. We got to get in here. Let's pull these out for now. I don't have my glasses on, so I can't tell if these are dollars or half dollars yet. But if that thing was filled with money, then there's more to be found. All right, so we are home. We're banging the shit out of this. Safe here. I believe we were almost there on getting it open. So we're gonna slam it on the corner a few more times and try and pry it open and see what's in it. Well, we're hoping that there's something valuable, but not breakable because we're banging the crap out of it and we are just about, we just gotta get past these two here and then we are good to go. All right, we just did our last bang and we got it open. We haven't looked in it yet. So let's go guys. All right, here we go, moment of truth. Moment of truth. We don't need that. This is interesting. A little box. A little bag, a little jewelry bag. Clear bags that are empty. Don't look like there's much in it. But we didn't open up these things yet, so. Looks like everything is out of the safe, which is no good. Uh, it looks like there was a pipe in here. So it looks like these people might have been some type of drug dealers because there's a lot of little bags in here. A lot of empty bags. Broken pipe that we shattered. Well, the safe was a bust, guys. Well, we didn't open those two things yet. Let me go get my flashlight. Okay, so the safe was a bust. No pun intended. There's nothing in here but a whole bunch of empty baggies and a broken pipe that we could have used, <laughs> but we broke it. So what is this? Okay, let's check out, see what's in these things here. It doesn't feel like there's anything in this coach bag. which there's not. We can still get 10 bucks for the coach bag. Now let's see what's in this box. More baggies, a whole thing of baggies. We don't know what's in there yet. Nope, nothing we can use in here. What's this? Oop, this feels like there's something in here. We just dropped our flashlight. Let me get it. I don't even want to know what this is. Probably hits of acid. I guess we found a druggie. Uh, anything else in here? Let me see. 
So obviously those hits of acid are gonna go in the trash down the toilet bowl. Let's see what this is. There's stuff in this thing. Her textbook. Well, unfortunately, the safe was a bust. Uh, we did find a whole bunch of drugs. So they're gonna go flush down the toilet bowl or in the trash. Uh, these are just empty bags. We can get five bucks for this nice metal box. It does have the key for the lock. We get another 10 for that little coach perch. All right, so a week later, we are back here at our unit and we are gonna go through it properly price everything, figure out what we got. See you in a bit. Okay, so we got to this unit here. Let's open this up and see what we got in here. Close. Oh, wait, there's other stuff in here too. All right, let's check this out. All right, all right we got this box down. Let's see what we got in here. All right, it looks like a bunch of miscellaneous stuff. We wanna go through it, hopefully find jewelry box or something. Okay, so we found a bunch of nice wall art, a lot of mirrors, a lot of shelving units, all brand new, excellent condition. We're looking at about $75 for the full box. Uh, we got some mirrors and some other pictures outside that we're gonna show you real quick. Here's one of the mirrors we found in that box and a bunch of little circle mirrors. So yeah, that was an easy $75 box right there. Okay, we got into this bin, uh, a lot of bubble wrap, a lot of these perfume bottles. We just looked this one up on eBay. Uh, this one is selling for 15 bucks. So I think we found a jewelry box in here. So let's see what else we got going. Okay, so in that box, we found a nice HP laser printer, 10 bucks. Jewelry box, unfortunately, was empty. Uh, we got two bucks for that. There was a lot of little office supply things in here. We'll get a buck each for all of that. Okay, so everything in that tub that we just put outside, that figure with all the little tchotchkes, that's a hundred dollar tub. Uh, we found a nice little wall shelf here. On the, back, on the back, we got a tag of 40 bucks. So I will sell this for another 20. All right, we're into another box. It looks like we got a little garden unit here. Uh, but we got these glass things that are all bubbled wrapped. We're going to take a look at these. Okay, back to this ottoman we found last week. It's loaded with brand new picture frames and fl floating shelves. So uh, we can get about 30 bucks for the continents. And then we have a nice top for this. We can get about 20 bucks for the unit itself. All right, it looks like we got a little kitchen unit here. We did find a laminator. Uh, in the in that little kitchen thing, ten bucks. What is this? Oh, I forgot the name of this thing. Ten bucks for that. All right, we found a toaster. And we found in, something in this box. There's an Apple iPhone in here. Well, a box, so we don't know yet. So let's open this up. More picture frames. Let's see what we got in here. Okay, so we went through this. We took out the stuff over here. We're going to look at. If we piece this unit, this box out here, uh, out for garage sale, we got 20 bucks for everything in there. All right, we found a, a phone protector, an iPad protector. I guess these are small iPads, RCA, I don't know. But I've got charges for everything at home, so we'll charge these up, see what they are. We found a broken iPad, um, iPhone, which is no good, a wire. We're going to hit this box here. All right, we got a nice storage box here filled with art books, craft items for art. We got 10 bucks for that box. We got this wicker basket here filled up with arts, crafts, and supplies. We got another 10, another 10 bucks for that. All right, we got a nice dual window fan, another 10 bucks. All right, we got a little uh, fireplace space heater here. If this works, we got 20 bucks there. We found another DVD player, a couple more clocks. So we got another 20 bucks there. All right, so we got a pull out love seat here. We got the cushion up there. We got that nice dresser. So the pull out love seat, we got 20 bucks for. 
That nice dresser will get 30. We've got a better dresser back underneath there, underneath the black box that we just uh, uncovered out. We'll get 50 for that. We're gonna look at this bed set here now. We have all these glass shelves for this entertainment unit, as well as this TV stand here. All right, so as we're going through the unit, we're finding more stuff. That garden box we found before uh, had a lot of little glass planters in there, all kinds of stuff. So we're looking at $25 for that full box right there. There was a little table in there as well, one of those little folding tables. We'll just add that in with the 25 bucks. Okay, so we just posted this shelf uh, online for 20 bucks on Facebook Marketplace. We posted this one on for 10 bucks. We just sold this one already for $10. Uh, we put this one up. It's an entertainment center uh, for 15 bucks. That brown hutch that we looked at over there, we just sold that. We're waiting for the person to come before we load this up. We sold this for 35 bucks. We just posted this uh, TV stand here for another 25 bucks. And we're gonna post this up here right now. We're gonna post this for 10 bucks. We just sold this black little leather ottoman on Facebook Marketplace. We sold this for 15 bucks. All right, so we went through our unit. We've been set, we've been posting stuff on Facebook Marketplace as we're going through it. We're selling stuff. We just had five or six people come by and, and pick up some stuff we sold. Uh, our unit's all packed up right now. There's my stuff way over there. I'm just waiting for my ride. And then I got a lot of pictures of everything that I've sold that I'm selling. And then uh, when I get back home, I'll put this up. I'll put this uh, video all together and we'll get it on our new, new YouTube page. All right, so we are home. We are sitting in the warmth of our house. We're not freezing. Uh, we're working on the video. We're still selling stuff. People are still messaging me on Facebook. That sound bar uh, that we found, we just sold that for, we sold the sound bar for $25. That electrical unit, the, it was a TENS unit. We sold that. We sold that for $90. All that change that we found, we, found, we got $175 worth of change. We have somebody coming by to pick up those two drawer felt gray shelving units. We have somebody coming by the house to pick them up as well as the heater, that electric heater worked also. So we sold that for 25 bucks as well. Okay, so everything that we figured out, we sold, we went through. Uh, I have it all written down here. We're gonna put it on a computer after all of this. Uh, so far, we're up to a total of $1,150. Not too bad for an $81 unit. Uh, we've already made our money back twice by selling all this stuff. All the little stuff, all the yard sale stuff and everything we didn't go through, we didn't put on video. Uh, we're estimating that around another 200 Oh, that power washer, that, that Bissell's hand steam cleaner, uh, 65 bucks we got for that. Uh, and all the other stuff that we didn't put on video, we found some more vacuums, uh, some Swift wet jets, uh, some toaster oven, you know, just stuff like that. Uh, we, I added all of that up and I'm figuring that to be about another 300 uh, so yeah, we had a pretty good, uh, session here on our first recorded storage auction, I guess you want to call it. There's still a lot of stuff that we haven't, we have to go through. There was a lot of carpet runners. There was a big carpet, uh, stuff like that. I'm not even going to worry about that right now. Uh, we'll just go through that at another time. There was, uh, tons and tons of clothes, uh, the clothes we're going to just donate uh, to the Salvation Army, uh, as well as all the kitchen pots and pans and dishes and all of that stuff. Uh, that's all going to be donated into the Salvation Army. 
So thanks for checking out the video. It was fun for me. I hope it was fun for you. Uh, hopefully we're going to start making more of these videos, yard sales, storage units, estate sales, as I said before, uh, hopefully, uh, this can become our new, our new thing. Again, thank you for, uh, checking out the video. Check the links in the description and have a great day.